Hello and a very warm welcome. It's race week once again as Formula One heads to Italy. Imola, Emilia Romanga. Um, yeah, and we will have round seven at a Formula One season. This one is a bit of a strange one because I just looked at the weekend and I'm thinking to myself, surely there's going to be a sprint round here and there's not actually a sprint round here. So we're going to have three practice sessions around a pretty basic track. Imola is a very fast track. You can do a lap time in around 1 minute 15, 1 minute 20 between that bracket. So I'm quite surprised. Like, I don't like sprints, but a venue like this should have a sprint race because you do not need three practice sessions around this track. Like I say, you've got the long straight, then you've got the twisty, it's so fast, the first sector. Then you come into this corner on the picture. Um, yeah. Imola obviously has a lot of history in Formula 1. The famous Alonso-Michael Schumacher battle. George Russell, Valtteri Bottas, big shunt. Um, and obviously, a couple of weeks ago, we had the anniversary for Ayrton Senna. Roland Ratzenberger, so it is quite fitting that F1 still comes here all these years on. As a track for racing, it's not amazing, but one lap quali, it must be a thrill to go around here because it is so fast. Like even the first corner, um, so fast, left, right, and then into sector one. Then you come up the hill. Um, the famous one, um, Montoya and Schumacher. Oh, I was alongside him, but he still didn't see me. You need to be blind. That's stupid. Um, just brilliant moments. But yeah, I am quite shocked that there's three practice sessions around Imola. Um, yeah, I feel that's not needed. So I can understand why they try and tinker with these sprints. But... I've just been watching MotoGP again, and I've got to say, once again, it was an amazing race. Three riders going for the lead, uh, Martin, Bagnaia, and Marquez. And it's, it's night and day between MotoGP and Formula 1 at the minute. Formula 1 really need to get some better racing and competition, because other motorsport disciplines are better. World Endurance. IndyCar, MotoGP, British Touring Cars. Um, yeah, and F1 is above all them for like history, pinnacle, speed. But at the minute, it's not delivering. I'm looking forward to Imola, but like I say, I'm a bit shocked about the free practices. And for racing, it's not amazing. We will be doing a preview later in the week. Can McLaren get back-to-back -back wins? Or is it going to be business as usual? And Max takes the victory. Uh, Mercedes, uh, I've seen they may be bringing upgrades. They need a lot of upgrades. Um, yeah, looking forward to it. The channel has also hit 600 subscribers. But I'll probably do a video about that when we get to like 604. So we're past it. Because usually when you're on 600, someone will unsubscribe. And then you look like a moron. Comment down below your thoughts as we head to round seven. Imola. Um, yeah, should be interesting. Join me later in the week for a preview. Qualifying reaction, race reaction, driver ratings. Bring it on.